Before I uh, share with you a uh, final blessing, I'd like to uh, mention that uh, you know, it's always good to remember and be reminded of God's unfailing love for us, particularly when we face, when we go through challenging times, tough times, difficulties. So it's good to be reminded that our God will never leave us. He will never forsake us. Also would like to read certain verses from Romans chapter 8. I did mention Romans 8 in our study tonight, particularly highlighting the truth that nothing can separate us from God's unfailing love. Let me restart with verse 31, the second part of Romans 8. If God is for us, who can be against us? Verse 32, He who did not spare His own Son, but gave Him up for us all, how will He not also, along with Him, graciously give us all things? Who will bring any charge against those whom God has chosen? It is God who justifies. Who is He that condemns? Christ Jesus, who died, more than that, who was raised to, rot, to life, is at the right hand of God and is also interceding for us. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall trouble or hardship or persecution or famine or nakedness or danger or sword? And then verse 37, the resounding answer, no, in all these things, we are more than conquerors through Him, through our God, who loved us. Congregation of the Lord Jesus Christ, may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the unfailing love of God the Father, the fellowship of of the Holy Spirit be with you now and forevermore. Amen.